Thanks for the hint, Esky. Hey, but when you said they asked him to leave, you didn't... You didn't mean the people who live around here, right? No. These people never actually do anything. They couldn't get rid of Khan for months before. Why would they do it now? Still dodging the question. Still not sure if you deserve an answer. Yeah, but kicking someone out of the community just because he was... rude? Isn't that a little bit cruel? Could be. But there's only a tiny wall between us and a swarm of bandits and zombies and who knows what else. One man's big mouth could be enough to tear this place apart. And you're okay with that? You know, if he can't find shelter out there, he's a dead man. Oh, come on. You're from the city. You know people like Khan, don't you? They always find a way to survive. He'd barter with a corpse if it meant he'd get away from trouble. No point asking what you were arguing about with your father? No. No point. Yeah, but still, you're the only one here who's speaking to me. Well, I can understand their attitude, but I don't have to agree with their methods, do I? So you guys would just rather see me gone? Well, no. Look, people here have gotten used to someone taking care of them. All thanks to the mother and her servants. Servants? Just help the people, all right? Do something spectacular, and soon enough you'll see for yourself. Customer is a blessing. You're actually selling something out here? Water. Crystal clear. No diarrhea afterburns. Tastes as if an angel stepped on your tongue, huh? One gallon for ten pounds of food. We accept gold as well. Ten pounds of food for water? What are you gonna start charging for air too? Oh, we got us a haggler. Look down there, punk. See that? That's Roscoe. We turn hagglers over to him. Still want to haggle, huh? Tell you what, though. I might let you trade your ride for some water. Oh, fuck you, asshole. So be it. All right, boys. Fuck him up.
Right here! Jazir sent me. Or what Eski did. You're one of the three who got lost? The only one left. I am Ali. They got thrown to that... that beast. Okay, listen, Ali, this place has to be at least sort of operational. Otherwise, the bandits wouldn't have had any water. The bandits have water here, but there is none at the farm. Nothing. Cross your fingers. If we did that right, in a couple of minutes there'll be water at the farm again. It's not working. Why is it not working? Oh shit! Shit! They must have closed it! And this equipment's fucking ancient! Pipes burst. We are all well and truly fucked. I'll get the valve open. Where is it? Get the shit out of me. All I know is it ain't here. Through the pipeline. 
For fuck's sake, hurry! Go! I'll keep trying on this head. Go! And hurry! here. I got it. But the place was already flooded, so now what? We just we just wait? Yes. Now it should just be a matter of time. So we're good? We're better than good. I think you just saved all our asses. Get back to the farm. I'll tell just here you're all right. You know. For a stranger.
miracle. It's a damn miracle. Yeah. Water. We don't talk to strangers. You don't even know what you just did for us. Our wells have been polluted for the last month, and people were getting sicker and sicker. Maybe I was wrong about you, stranger. So, any chance you'll answer my question now? About that medicine? Follow me, please. Vizier and Haran, we're running out of Antizen. I'm looking for anything that could save my friends. If you have anything... Yes, stranger, we do. We have our faith and our prayers to the Mother. Faith? Uh, okay, I, I mean no disrespect, but you, you're telling me that prayers keep you from turning? That's your problem. You lack faith, just like the other outsiders. We believe in the Mother, and she protects us. We have no need of... Antonsen, or whatever you said. Okay, okay, well, is there any way I could maybe speak with this mother? She is sacred. She speaks only with those known as the faceless. But maybe, maybe you could get them to notice you. If you do enough good for our community. At this point, I'll take anything. So what kind of good are you looking for? What, what needs to be done around here? You're serious about this. <laughs> All right, then. Me, I take care of this farm. And my friend Bilal keeps the gas station near town safe. Look around. You'll find more work than any one man could handle. 